Welcome to day two of what we ate from the ultimate raw vegan bundle. This day was a special day. It was Nate's 46th birthday, so we made some goodies. We dug into the bundle and we found some deliciousness to make. So come with us and check out what we made for Nate's birthday. All the delicious food from the bundle. Of course, we have to prep everything that we need the day before if there's anything we need to prep. And we decided to make the coconut breakfast burrito wraps from my brand new hand salads ebook. So we had to blend those the night before so they were ready in time for lunch the next day. We also opened our coconuts and got those ready because we we're going to blend them the next day. We just kept the coconut jelly in the fridge. That morning, we made the Vampire Cayenne Smoothie from Alana Jordan, her ebook, Smoothies and Spice and Everything Nice, that's in the bundle. This was a delicious one. We really love how she includes spices in her smoothies. It's a great book. I hope you get to enjoy it. Then, first thing in the morning, we made sure to get our quiche patties blended up and mixed up and in the dehydrator so that they would be ready for lunch. Planning is so important on a raw diet and learning when to schedule in the prep and make sure it gets done is a skill that you can acquire with practice. Just reading over the recipe and learning when you need to do things, just schedule it in, set an alarm and make sure it gets done. I love using the ice cream scoop to portion out the raw vegan quiches. And this recipe again is in the hand salads ebook. This is one of our absolute favorite recipes and these are gonna be inside our coconut breakfast burrito wrap. None of the wraps have coconut or oil in them. This recipe just has coconut in the quiche patty itself. You could also use a mix of zucchini and soaked sunflower seeds if you wanted to skip out on the coconut, but we do like to use coconut for this because it has the most perfect texture for these quiche patties. We also had to blend and prepare the penne pasta noodles. This recipe is unreal. I am so blown away with the creativity of Lena Laloon. She is in the bundle. Her ebook is called Next Level Pasta and it's got some really super creative stuff. Please go grab the bundle, check out all the brand new content, the never before released recipes. There's over 400 recipes in this bundle and the bundle's worth over $1,800. It's all our new content. It's yours for 50 bucks. Just click that link in the description box below and go grab all these new goodies. So these carrot penne noodles are so interesting. I actually filled the entire tray. She says to make it like a circle. I filled the entire tray just to see if I could get any extra in. But as it turns out, they're better when they are in a circle. But nevertheless, we're learning, so we put these into the dehydrator at the same time as the quiche early in the morning when we made our smoothie. So these could sit in the dehydrator for about five hours or so, five to six hours before they would be ready. The penne noodles we're having for dinner, so we really had to get those in early in the morning so that they would be ready. The wraps would be ready to go for lunch, and we're all set. Nate loves carrot cake. It's one of his favorite and because it's his birthday, I wanted to secretly make him the carrot cake recipe from my mom's ebook, which is also in the bundle. So while he was out running an errand, I secretly made the carrot cake for him. Put it in the freezer just until we could finish it up and I went and cut some of the microgreens to get ready for lunch so it was ready when he got home. These are the purple kohlrabi. I also used some broccoli microgreens as well. It's so nice to add microgreens to our 
wraps. It fills it up, it adds more nutrition, and it's delicious. I also harvested more leaves off our lettuce grow farm stand. This farm stand has been so wonderful. If we just need a couple of leaves for a wrap, it's there for us. And here are all the ingredients laid out for the coconut breakfast burrito wrap that is available in my brand new hand salads ebook. This is one of 33 recipes that you can make to make delicious wraps. And it's not just the wrapper recipe. You get the recipes for the matching fillings and the matching sauces. Of course, you can mix and match. You can choose your own fillings, anything that you want to add, and you can choose your own sauce. It doesn't have to be exactly the way my recipe is, but it just gives you really fun ideas. So we have the quiche, the microgreens, the harvested lettuce and some red onion, and the sunchokes. These are the sunchokes that we love so much. They're not potatoes, they're raw. They've just been chopped, marinated, and frozen and thawed. So we have a cashew cream cheese that we're putting on our wrap. Now you don't need to use a cashew cream cheese if you didn't want to, but there are recipes for different flavors of cashew cream cheese in this ebook. So you'll be able to make some delicious fermented cashew cheeses at home. The cool thing about these wraps is you can fit a lot in each one and each recipe makes two big wrappers just like this. So you can make enough for yourself for lunch the next day or for you and your loved one. Fold it up just like an envelope, give it a nice gentle but firm squeeze and roll it up. Check it out. It's ready to be cut in half. And enjoyed. Look at that. It's so delicious. We're really excited for lunch today. I plated them up and we enjoyed them for lunch. These are incredibly filling wraps. They're delicious and they are great for taking with you to work, traveling, for school, or really just because they're really fun to eat and make. We love adding different sauces to them. Dips are so amazing with these wraps, but this one is so flavorful that it doesn't need any extra sauces. So we just enjoy it just as it is with all its coconut quiche deliciousness. While Nate was working on something in the office, I snuck into the kitchen and I finished up the prep for the carrot cake. Again, this recipe is in my mom's ebook. It's called My Gentle Kitchen, and you can get it in the bundle. This is a nice vanilla cashew icing, and we added a little bit of cinnamon to the top. I decorated it with some strawberries and some mint leaves. And then we put it into the fridge so that we could wait until after dinner to take it out and sing him happy birthday. I quickly snuck some pictures for Instagram and some video for this video. And then at dinner time, it was back in the kitchen to create some art. I cut the carrot penne wraps into circles the way Lena suggested in her ebook. I poured a little bit of tahini on the wrapper so that it would be sticky as I rolled it. I personally cut them in half. She has suggested to use the entire sheet rolled up, but I cut it in half so that the noodles were a little less thick and we had more of them because why not have more noodles, right? So I kept them under the knife to keep them in that state while I made the jicama slaw from my mom's ebook. I did make a lot of recipes from my mom's ebook because I mean, she's my mom and they are so delicious. Nate said that that slaw was one of his favorites. And then I cut the penne noodles on an angle so they look like penne noodles. These were so cool and it didn't matter to me if they were coming undone a little bit because they were absolutely delicious and so worth it. I had this amazing tomato sauce blended in the food processor. This is all Lena's recipe for 
Pasta Al Arrabbiata in her ebook called Next Level Pasta. This sauce was so good and the noodles were so good and the salad was so good. These was just absolutely delicious. I'm so glad that we made this for Nate's birthday because it was so much fun, so creative, and of course, it was so delicious. So after I portioned everything out, I sprinkled with a little bit of parsley, added some basil for decoration, and here we go. These are our plates. This was really filling. <laughs> it doesn't look like it's much, but it was so filling, and the salad was so refreshing. Really nice compliment to the penne noodle pasta. Bundle time is one of my absolute favorite times of the year because we get to explore the creations from so many other creators. The different flavor palettes, the different textures that they like to use. It's so cool to explore new dishes and find new favorites that we can add to our menu that we do on a regular basis. We'll definitely be making both the pasta and the salad again. Now let's go sing Nate happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Aww. Happy birthday to you. <whistles> happy birthday to you, Nate. Happy birthday to what you. What is it? What is it? I'm always smelling. He's smelling. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> that looks amazing. What is mm. it? It's a carrot cake. What? Whose recipe is that? My mama's. Oh, it's gonna be so good. It's for you. Look at that. <clears throat> that looks incredible. <laughs> oh my gosh. Let's get some pictures. Yes, yes, pictures. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Yes, have the first bite. <laughs> Look at that! Wow. Mm. Happy birthday! Mm. Did you make one too? This for both of us. Wait, I don't get this all? Well, you can have it I'm all. I'm just kidding. <laughs> yup. Mm. Mm. So good. So good. And there we go. It was another epically delicious day making the coconut breakfast burritos, the penne noodles, the carrot cake, the jicama slaw, and that delicious smoothie in the morning. It is so fun, like I said, to explore new recipes, and I hope you do too by grabbing the ultimate raw vegan bundle. This bundle is only happening once in 2023, and it's all brand new content. There's over 400 recipes in there, there's 40 contributions, and it's worth over $1,800. If you were to buy all of our new content separately, that's how much you would be paying for everything, but we're gifting it to you for only $50. That's it, but we can only do it until May 11th. So here's your chance. Click the link in the description box below. Go check out all the cool stuff that we've got for you in this brand new bundle. And you can make some cool recipes just like this and enjoy adding more variety, more hydration, more nutrition, and more raw foods to your diet. Don't forget, we also have the live events happening right now where all of us are going live with each other. We're discussing topics. We're answering your questions. We're sharing inspiration and stories. So head on over to the website and check out the live events schedule on the menu. You can click on the live events schedule 
and find all the lives that you can attend and learn from us. Thank you so much for joining me for another What We Ate in a Day from the Ultimate Raw Vegan Bundle. You can enjoy all these recipes too. Just click the link in the description box below. We'll be back tomorrow for day number three where we will be creating more recipes for breakfast, lunch, and dinner from the Ultimate Raw Vegan Bundle. Love you guys so much. Thank you so much for joining, and we will see you tomorrow. Fruit on.